Welcome to this month's release of Design Fusion's Solid Edge blog. In this blog, we'll look at the colored section cut faces in Solid Edge 2023. In previous versions of Solid Edge, section cut faces were the same color as the model. If the model was all the same color, distinguishing individual section faces could be difficult. In Solid Edge 2023, you now have colored section cut faces. Colored section cut faces apply to both section and section by plane commands. The colored section cut faces are available in part, sheet metal, and assembly environments. To accommodate this new functionality, a new sectioned faces field has been added to the color manager. Users can define different colors for different parts for use in the assembly sections. Let's have a look at this in Solid Edge 2023. In this assembly, I use section by plane to create a section view, and I'll show it so that you can see it. If we go to the front view, you'll see that most of the faces are all the same color due to the fact that the parts are all the same color. To assign color to these section cut faces, I'll first select the part, and then in this case, I will open the part. In the part, I'll go and select the Color Manager command found on our View tab. Notice the new Select Faces field on the Color Manager, and here I'll select the color blue and hit OK to accept it. I'll then save the part file and close it. Back in the assembly, you'll notice that the blue now appears on the section cut faces. I'll repeat this step, but this time instead of opening a part, I'll edit into the part. Once in the part, I'll go and select the color manager command again and change the section faces to the desired color and click OK. Since I used edit into the part, I get a preview of the section faces before I return to the assembly. I then hit close and return to return to my assembly. I'll repeat the edit into place process once again using the handle. This time when I go to select the color manager command, I'll use a different color other than blue. Each part you select, you can assign different colors to the section cut faces. And again, I'll hit close and return to return to the assembly. We'll repeat this again, this time with the nut. And again, I'll use the edit method. As with other color assignments, once you assign this field and save the part, it stays with the part until you change it. Let's edit into one more part. For this final part, I'll assign a section face color of red. When I hit OK, I see the face turn red in the part file. However, when I close and return, you'll notice that it doesn't turn red here. The reason this face did not turn red is because I have a assembly face override assigned to it. If I turn that to none, then I'll get my red section cut face appear. I'll go back to the front view and you can see it's much easier to distinguish the different faces when they're colored. So that's how you assign section cut faces in Solid Edge 2023. If you want to learn more about Solid Edge, check out our online training page at designfusion.com online training. Customers can also reach out to our support team at 1-877-215-1883 or email us at support at designfusion.com.